Four days after a Queens mother of two was found brutally murdered and shoved into a duffel bag, the search for her killer continues. For neighbors, it's a crime they can't stop thinking about. It's shocking. It's just, uh, it's hard to believe. Police have no suspects, but sources are providing PIX11 News with new details in this case. They say the victim, or Shia Gall, went to see a show at Lincoln Center in Manhattan, and then afterwards headed to a bar Friday night. The sources tell us the 51-year-old mother spent 45 minutes waiting for someone who never showed. At some point, Gall ended up back at her home here on Juno Street in Forest Hills. It's here where detectives say she was murdered in the early morning hours of Saturday stabbed nearly 60 times in the basement. The killer then shoved Gall's body inside a hockey duffel bag and dragged her down the street. Police say she and the bag were dumped about a half mile away from her home. Sources say soon after, a threatening text message from Gall's phone was sent to her husband. It warned him if he went to police, his entire family would be killed. Although the alleged killer was recorded on camera dragging the bag with Gall in it along the sidewalk, investigators aren't sure who this person is. Detectives believe Gall knew her killer because there were no signs of someone forcing their way into her home. Just why it happened, you know, who did it, you know, it's a, it's a good neighbor, why did this happen? Investigators have since broadened their search and say they could not be looking for multiple suspects. The NYPD, in the meantime, is trying to coax the clues they need from people with possible information. The department is offering a $3,500 reward for any information leading to an arrest. Orshia Gall's husband and her two teenage sons have not been back to their house since this murder investigation began. Neighbors we've talked to say they just hope this all comes to a conclusion as soon as possible.